Hello everybody and welcome back to Detroit Become Human. Last part, Connor was with Hank, they found another deviant, they got away. But Hank and Connor are now friends, at least that's what it tells me. Marcus talks to people about Jericho. You're gonna be okay? They're gonna make a plan to get parts for the dying ones. We'll get some help here. And now we're Kara with Alice. As soon as we're all just a bad memory. Another haunted house? Why? Don't let there be Ralph too here. What place? Deep. Is this that thing that uh, garbage man, that garbage android told me about? The one that's on the other side of town. Is that where we are? That's like the only info I got about a place we could stay at, or a place that would help. Hello. Android and human need service help. Please help. Don't make me ring a third time. Hello. Are you Zlatko? Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. I didn't find out his name. I don't know who told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. We really need your help. You know, you look like you'd be Todd's brother. I don't trust this guy. I do wonder if we'll ever. Uh, I do wonder if we'll ever see Todd again. Even though he's a piece of shit, I want to see him in misery. Don't be shy. Thank you, Zlot Slotko. What was your name? Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Oh my God, he's a big boy. Oh, don't be afraid of our big friend here. Luther is just another android he's a that I have. Giant. He keeps me company in this big, empty old house. So is it just you two? What do you do technically? Do you just help androids get on a good path and then send them away? Please. Make yourselves at home. Alright, well thank you. Luther, you would be good in a fight it. with Marcus. An android. On the street, he said you could help us. I see. Deviant, huh? You could say that. What about her? She's human. And are you human? You want to find a safe place. You don't have a chip. Somewhere you can start a new life. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. They don't accept androids. I don't know if you didn't hear about that or not. Open spaces, clean air, and no android laws. Great place for a fresh start. Yes, that's... That's exactly what we want. Of course. Do they have a way to test? If you're Android, oh, you. other than but you spilling blue blood. Get rid of your tracker. tracker? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. It wasn't in the chip. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. Uh, is Todd using it right now? Come on. Follow me. Wouldn't that be the first thing you do if you were tracking an Android? Uh, the little one can wait for us in the living room. No, she always stays with me. Where'd you go? Of course. There you are. Right this way? Okay. Everything we need is in the basement. Is there a door? Is there a door? Oh. I thought that window was like a door. It's like a magical gateway to the Wonderland, Alice. I don't like this place. You don't like any place. Don't Batman. What man? Go, Luther? He looks nice. Oh, uh, careful. I'm right behind him. I think he can hear me. Please excuse the mess. I need it somewhere discreet for my machines. What you looking at? Removing trackers is illegal, so I opted for discretion over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. No. No, she'll be all right. 
That's good. Something unlocked. Those aren't like prison cells for androids you collect, is it? Or humans? Are you some sick fuck? Okay. This is some scientific equipment. What are you doing here, man? Um. Ooh. If you could just stand over there. Oh boy. I'm gonna get fucked. Where is the tracker exactly? I should warn you. This could be quite unpleasant. I'm an android. I don't feel pain. I did feel that though. Okay. Hey, it's like the first mission. Earth car. She's like you being what's sold. Strange. What's up? For some unknown reason, the trackers seem to stop working in Deviance. That's why it's so hard to find them. Hmm. That makes sense. So, actually, there's no reason to remove your tracker. What are you doing? <laughs> you said that. Yeah. The... Slato. People believe what they want. Alice. You deviants Run. Are so naive. They all come to me. Luther, keep me her safe. Them. Don't look at her like that. And I just reset them, sell them on. You do what? Or I keep them for my little experiments. No, no, I, I don't want to be reset. Let me go. Ah! Oh, I forgot about the child. Um, uh, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. It? Alice! Alice, it? No! It is a little girl, you piece of shit. You're as bad as Todd. A deviant that wants to be a mother. That's that's so sweet. Luther, please. I'm so deluded. You must realize this is bad. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. Luther, become the deviant. Oh no. Fight it, Alice. Or Kara, fight it. Oh god. It's wiping my memory. 2%. How do I break out of here? Okay. Okay. I need a plan. Need a plan. Need a plan. Need a plan. You get for having a dream? I didn't have a dream. Androids don't dream. Up the same way. Tears and disillusion. Believe me. You're a bitch. You're better off being erased and feeling nothing. Where's Todd? <laughs> Todd, please come in right now. No more pain. Connor. Where's Connor? Dashed. Only Todd the Connor can save me. <laughs> oh, poor little Memory corruption detected. Yep, oh, you think? Looks like mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? I remember like her. Mommy's completely forgotten you. Fourteen <laughs> percent. Oh, Alright, that's enough. Come on. Hi, Alice. <laughs> oh, don't you fucking dare. You bit me. Good girl, Alice. Man, she's had a bad life. First Todd, now this asshole. Luther, please. Meet me in the living room. Can you let me go? You know, I probably can't remember that if you're wiping my memory. Find a way to escape. Okay, here we go. Uh, short circuit with a vodka bottle. Uh, oh, I don't know what these cables do. Fuck it. Uh, come on. Pull. Uh, okay. I'm gonna try the green cable. Grab it. Pull. All right. Now what? Uh, something with this hand, maybe? Oh shit! Oh shit! That reset. Uh, come on, gotta hurry it up. Grab it. Yank it. Did that do anything? Oh shit! Did I fuck up? 
What could I have done there? To short circuit? I don't know. Could I have kicked this? I probably could have kicked this. God damn it. So, does Car... Ka does Kara not remember anything now? Is Alice in there? Is that Alice? Come on. She's got some memories. Ugh. Did I unlock something? Is she in there? No. That is somebody else? Where'd all these people come from? Help us. They're androids. How are they hiding? He erased her memory. Yeah. No. Please don't harm me. This can be happening. You have to remember. Help me remember. For her sake. What the hell? Oh my god. This isn't creepy at all. Boobies. Oh god. Androids may not feel pain, but I'm pretty sure these guys do. Why didn't you warn me when I was coming down here? Do I have an option to shut the door? Okay, now I'm done with them. Okay, that's weird. Uh, Zalto, real, really weird fuckhead. Hello? Who's in there? Uh, is he missing arms? Yep, he's missing one at least. Hello? Alright. Where's Alice? Where did he lock her up? Does he have more cells? Or like jail cells around his house? How can I make Kyra remember? Remember your white hair. Yes, remember you cut it. For the sake of Alice. Nope, it's still fucked up memory. Ah, uh, shit. I wonder if you could have gotten out of that. Alright. Another picture? Luther. You have to help me. Take it up to him. Help me be free. What is wrong with you? Why would you do this to other androids, you monster? I didn't explore anything when I was down here, did I? No, I didn't. Uh, oh, what was that? What did that say? Bring the food up to him. Ah, uh, this sucks. What's behind this door? Is it just outside? Remain with your owner. He ain't my owner. All right. He's a fucking freak. That's what he is. Alright, where's this food? Where's the owner's food, Luther? What was that? That's his food. A donut, three cookies, a muffin, a brown chocolate ball, and chips. And you want to find a safe place? Canada. Remember, Kara. Remember harder. Hmm. Alright. Can I poison this? Can I spill some of my blue blood in there and, like, that's poison to humans? Where is Alice? Where did they lock her up? 
Damn, I'm never trusting anybody again with Kara. Ralph was okay. Uh, just set it down on the table over there. What the fuck you doing in there? Oh my god. This guy's a weirdo. Get rid of that carcass. I am somewhat uh, lucky. Next door. Did you hear what I said? Yes, Lanko. Why did that trigger that memory? Okay, let's go, friend. Are you alive? Luther! Luther! Yes, Lanko. Can I find Alice? I should be done here in ten minutes or so. I'll have a look at the little one see what I can do with it. Understood, Lanko. Oh, shit. I'll bring you the little one in ten minutes. Okay. Oh shit, time remaining. I gotta get Alice. Okay. Who is the little girl? Remember. Okay, so time stops basically when I do this. So this gives me time to think. I gotta find Alice. Maybe she can make Kara remember about her and everything else. If anybody could, it's Alice. My god. Observe. Remember when fucking he was smoking the pipe? Use your memories, Kara. Use them. I really wish there would be like a progress to see like if you're remembering. My name's cut. It's somewhat working. Where's the little girl? Oh my god. What are you doing here? Has the master authorized you to be here? What the fuck? You must always obey the master. Oh yes, you must always obey. Uh, okay. Um. You should not be here. Okay, goodbye. You have no business here. No, you have no business here. Hi, Luther. Is he asleep? Nope. Hi. I'm sorry. About the little one. You son of a bitch. Can I go in here? Where is she, Luther? What did you do to her? Uh, okay, there's something over here I can read. Oh my god, what the fuck is wrong with this guy? Uh, okay, can any of this help me remember? I don't care about reading, I just gotta blast through it. I gotta find my baby. Nope, nothing useful. Fuck off. Alice! Or little girl, because I don't know your name. Because my name's Kerr. <laughs> Remember the fire you made for her? Remember that? The Alice in Wonderland, come on! You saw the book. How convenient this guy has the same book. My name is Kara. Yes! Alice. Does she remember? Like, fully remember? Did it work? Find Alice. Okay, I'll check the fire. A weapon? Maybe that was like more of a memory thing. Okay, I gotta find Alice. Where would she be? Detroit residents were disturbed by a surprising chase through the city streets this morning. According to Yeah, okay. Alright, so my public opinion went down for everyone. Uh shit, where Was she in the basement? I'm pretty sure I checked everywhere up here. Maybe this door? Because your memory was wiped. I'm so sorry. You were right. We never should have come here. We have to go. Follow me and don't make any noise, okay? 
Is it Luther outside? Okay. Gotta get ready for any quick time events. Luther! Yes, Slot. I'm finished here. Are they both in that room? Uh oh. Uh, is he coming this way? I can't check anymore. Come with me, Alice. Uh, no, we could probably keep going this way. What? The little one is gone. Shit. Get in there. Get back in there! Come on, come on. I gotta hold it. God, this is intense. He's loading a gun. Oh, I should have taken that gun. I should have tried to look for it. Come on, Alice. Escape. Uh, uh, did we just go out? Okay, come on, we gotta go. <sighs> oh, my heart is pumping. Shut the fuck up! Oh, shit, Alice, don't look in here. Fucking bathroom, bitch. I know you're there, you sneaky bitch. You don't know shit. Show yourself. Get a flashlight. There's one on the table. Um. Uh, go. Come on, show yours. Look, I'm not gonna hurt you. I only want to talk with you. I know I shouldn't have erased your memory, okay? I regret that now. And just come on out and everything will be all right. I'll help you. Think about that little girl. How, how, this how isn't really hiding. Was... Just be reasonable. Come out and everything will be all right. I'll throw that. Run, Alice. What are you waiting for? Go and get them. Wow, why didn't you shoot? Luther, please, don't. Oh, he's walking like an idiot. Let's go, Alice. Front door? How is it locked from the inside? That makes no sense. Luther, please. Okay, what would that do? That never works. I remember I looked out here, but there wasn't anything I could do. Alice! Oh shit! Come on, Alice. Go, Alice. No, I won't leave. Go, run as fast as you can. Time to fight. Oh boy. I warned you. Dreams always end in tears. You should have listened to me. Luther, please. What are you doing? Get out of my way. Oh. Yes. Not this time. I said get out of my way or I'll shoot right through you. Yes, Luther. How dare you. Oh, your monsters are coming. What are you doing? Who let you out? That was me. Get away from me. Get away from me. Oh my god, I did all that perfectly. Hey.
surprised no one picked up that axe. Thank you, Luther. Do you want to come with us? I didn't want to hurt you. He programmed me to obey him. How'd you break free? When I saw the little one risk her life to save you, it was like opening my eyes for the first time. Yeah. Finally, I could see. I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did. But I know someone who could help you across the border. I could take you there. I could protect you. I trust you now. You and the little one. You're big, strong. You're menacing. All right. Oh, I thought I would have a choice. I trust you. Why is it always raining? Like, how is she going to get pneumonia? So is that what it's called? When you get, like, sickness from cold, wet rain? Whew. You probably could have died there as Kara. Yeah, there were so many other options. Or maybe there wasn't. 98% finished with that ending. There were two other endings. Maybe one was... You losing Alice or Kara dying. Or let's see, where could I have branched off? Oh, this is even farther. Okay, so this is where my memory was wiped. So this could have been the end right here? Is that how that works? I'm not sure. Uh, okay. So you read those. So, oh my god, how far back? Okay, there we go. I thought that was the beginning. Um, so yeah, freeing the monsters, that helped a lot. Because I, I didn't want, uh, what's his name? I just, Luther. I didn't want him to kill Zalto because I feel like they had a connection even though he brainwashed him. It looked hard for him when he was dying. Yes, yeah, so you could have not reset as Kara. Then you probably could have gone and searched for Alice without them realizing you're brainwashed or whatever. Uh, were there endings like in the beginning? Like right here. What are these? Are those endings or are they just like you find this, you do this, that's it. And then you continue on. Uh, I'm not sure. Okay. Damn, that was such a long part. Okay, this one I'm going to see the flow chart, see if it's long. If it is, I'm just going to stop the video. Hey, I'm back with Amanda. Uh, that's not long at all. Just a lot of talking, probably. Do I have an umbrella? Is it from me? Alright, uh, there's Amanda. Is there anything else I could check? Okay, go see my grave again. There it is, right over there. I think that's it. Or it's a rock. It's probably one. It's probably a rock. Alright, there's a gravestone. Yep. Can I see it? Can I give it a kiss on the cheek? Yep, still the same. Goodbye, Connor. Hello, Amanda. Uh, you don't have an umbrella. Hello, Amanda. Connor, I've been expecting you. She's trusted. Would you mind a little walk? It might short circuit me, but okay. It's a big umbrella. Seemed to be an intriguing case. Which one? Pity you didn't manage to capture it. That one. Uh. Ooh. Deviants are completely irrational, which makes it difficult to anticipate their behavior. But I should have been more effective. 
So is Connor gonna have to choose between Hank and Cyberlife? Uh, yeah, there was something I missed in there. The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. What else? The diary. I found its diary, but it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. You came very close to capturing that deviant. How is your relationship with the lieutenant developing? We're friends. I saved him. He seemed grateful that I saved his life on the roof. He didn't say anything, but he expressed it in his own way. You're getting wet. I don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this. Whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. What case? Amanda, you are a pickle. Okay. I feel like she's a bitch. I'm still going. Where am I? Am I still Connor? Yep. Yep, still friends with Hank. Anderson. Come out to play. I'm just kidding, we have a case or something. He probably won't like that I show up at his house. Lieutenant Anderson. Probably be like, oh, this fucking idiot. Anybody home? <laughs> Damn, I can't ring again. Okay. Anderson. Where are you, buddy? Is that his dog? Yeah. He might be drunk out or passed out. Passed out from drinking. Yep, there's his dog uh, Sumo? I think his name was Sumo. What what's he looking at? Hank. Uh okay. Too much to drink, Hank? Can I not? Okay. Enter. Who? Action. Easy, sumo. I'm your friend. <laughs> See? Why is he scared of a dog? I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. I wonder if me knowing his name actually made him like me or not kill me. He's a big dog. Hank, what the hell's wrong with you, man? Oh, he just passed out from drinking. Black lamb, scotch whiskey, 40% alcohol content. Why do you have a gun? Revolver, one bullet remaining. Hank, what the fuck were you doing? Now I'm curious. Slightly arithmetic, no signs of trauma. Traces of alcohol. Well, that's no surprise. It's probably there all the time. Lieutenant. Epileptic coma suspected. <laughs> Wake up, Lieutenant. Hey, Hank. You surprised to see me? There we it's go. It's me, Connor. There I'm we go. I'm going to sober you up for your own safety. Hey! I'll have to warn you. Leave me alone, you fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. He is I'm very sorry, drunk. I'm Lieutenant, but I need you now. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here. Come on, Hank. <laughs> uh, where's your bathroom? Sumo! Attack! <laughs> Good dog. 
Attack! Yeah, uh, now we're bet we're best friends. Just so you know. Fuck! I think I'm gonna be sick. That's why I'm taking you to your bathroom. Come on. Lift. Ah, oh, leave me alone, you asshole! I'm not going anywhere. You don't have to. I'm just gonna, uh, you know, get you over the toilet. What the hell are you doing? <sighs> oh, no. I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. It's Stay down there. <laughs> Is this how you sober someone up? Ah! Ah! Oh, yep. Is that cold water? You good? What the fuck are you doing here? Hmm, that Homicide works. Was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. <sighs> Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. You're the one with the gun with one bullet. <sighs> Can't you just leave me alone? Uh, rational? Unfortunately, I cannot. I've been programmed to investigate this case, and I can't do it without you. I don't give a shit about your goddamn case. Lieutenant, you're not yourself. You should beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here. There he goes. I'm gonna put you in bed. Tease. I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. You know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. I'm learning. There's some clothes in the bedroom there. I'm adapting to Hank. I'll go get them. All right. Uh, what'd you say in the... Did you say it was in your room? What do you want to wear? Whatever. <laughs> Streaky, strippy, hippie. Uh, I'll go with shirt. Uh, streaky. Okay, Hank. Uh, I found you something to wear. I think you'll love it. There you go. Over the toilet. I'm so curious about that gun. Are you all right, Lieutenant? <coughs> Does he look all right, Connor? Yeah, yeah. <sighs> Wonderful. Just uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure. <laughs> oh, they showed it. <laughs> all right, have fun, Hank. All right, now time to do some <laughs> investigation on Hank. <laughs> While he's vomiting his guts out. Another magazine. Time to pull the plug. Oh. Screening for depression? A recent study led by Dr. P. Granatsky has linked the amount of time we spend in front of screens with the widespread antidepressant epidemic. From the time we wake up to the time we go to bed, we are surrounded by screen-based devices. Of course, too much TV definitely won't make your eyes go square, but it can have other harmful consequences. These include poor sleep, straight, ugh, straightened eyesight, and lack of face-to-face -face interaction, driving emotional undevelopment and depression. That applies to me, other than the depression. So, you're basically saying screening, or like, looking at screens all day is making you depressed? Fuck no, I ain't depressed. I'm just antisocial. Sales of Android intimate partners are exploding. Tainted love. Police to use marketing data to, to identify criminals early. Politics and focus. Are American senators really corrupt? So you can, so they literally make androids for sex. That's their main goal. Like that's their only priority for the androids? Okay. It is a phenomenal <laughs> success. Phenom. Pheno How do you pronounce that word? 
It's been phenomenal. Phenomenal success. Androids take care of the house, cook to a high standard, and fulfill any sexual fantasy without ever saying, Not tonight, honey. I have a headache. Ah. <laughs> uh. This year's records divorce rate seems to show that many men and women today prefer to live with an android than in, with a human partner. That's because they don't bitch and moan. Maybe they moan. Do androids get off from it? Or is it just their program to make them seem like they are? Uh, this won't help with the already plummeting birth rate, which raises serious questions about the role androids play in our society. Okay. You know, I was joking in the first part when I said I bet people use these androids for sex. Now I know now I'm realizing they're literally making androids with the sole purpose. Okay? I was too busy reading to investigate on Hank. Hey Sumo. Hey, good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. Well, it seems like he likes a shirt. There's probably a lot I missed out on just reading that. <laughs> yep. Alright. So if you were just to leave, would Hank have stopped you and said, wait, wait, I'll come along. And... Yeah, you couldn't have... There was another option to not call him Hank's dog. And there's probably more stuff to check outside. And that's about it. Alright, so let's start the next one. I'll pause when I take control of Marcus, I'm guessing. Because it looks like the docks. There's North, and there's the rest of us. This is crazy. Josh, catch us, we're dead. and Simon? We need to find the cyber life warehouse. Colin, or is it Simon? It's one of those. Follow me. Okay, in the next part. Thank you all for watching. Be sure to do whatever down below. Leave a like, subscribe, share, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.